Places to Amaze You by Grace Hansen. The Netherlands. The Netherlands has many tulip fields. They are colorful. They bloom every spring. Alaska, United States of America. The Mendenhall Glacier Ice Cave is in Alaska. The cave is under a 12-mile glacier, or 19 kilometers. Arizona, United States of America. Antelope Canyon is in Arizona. It was formed by flowing water. Maldives. The Sea of Stars is in the Maldives. Small animals in the water light up. They glow like stars. Turkey. Cappadocia is in Turkey. People like the hot air balloon here. Water flow created the waving rocks. Croatia. Plitvicica Lakes National Park is in Croatia. There are many caves and waterfalls. Let me say that again, okay, for you. It's Plitvichka Lakes National Park. Bolivia. Salar de Uni is in Bolivia. It is the world's largest salt flat. It can mirror the sky. Iceland. The Silfra Rift is in Iceland. It is part of the Atlantic Rift. Divers swim between two continents. Australia, the Great Barrier Reef is amazing. It is off the coast of Australia. It is very big. You can see it from space. More facts. The Netherlands is known for its tulips. The Netherlands sends Canada 10,000 tulip bulbs each year. It is to thank them for their help in World War II, which ended in 1946. Cappadocia is a Turkish fairy tale town. The view from above is amazing. But even more amazing is what is underground. There are miles of tunnels and rooms. It is called the underground city. The Great Barrier Reef is home to a huge number of plants and animals. Over 1,000 species of fish live there. Over 1,000 coral reef species live there. Sea turtles, starfish, whales, dolphins, and much more live there too. And a little glossary. The Atlantic Rift, a large crack that separates the Eurasian and North American plates. The crack goes right through Iceland. Continent, one of the seven main land masses on Earth. The seven are Europe, Asia, Africa, North America, South America, 
Australia and Antarctica. Glacier, a very big piece of ice that moves slowly. Salt flat, a desert lake where water has completely dried up, leaving high amounts of shiny crystals.